What the f*** is she doing? <laughs> what she doing? Hey internet, it's Jessica and welcome back to the quarry. In the last episode, we finally learned something about the monster. It is confirmed to be a werewolf curse. Uh, still don't know the origins of it, but I have a feeling we're gonna learn very soon. But Laura is alive, Max is alive, and there's a chance that we could stop and actually cure everybody. Even Nick and Emma, who I, you know, got infected by accident. But there is a chance to help this, but we're looking for Chris Hackett himself. And, uh, Laura is also bit. That's what we learned. So, a lot of crazy things are happening. And, uh, hopefully... This will end in a good way. I'm, I just don't know if I'm making the right choices. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough, remember to leave a like. If we can get the video, let's let's do 200 likes again. If we can do 200 likes again, I will continue uploading. Your guys' support actually helps a lot for the channel and the fact that I'm able to do these let's plays. So remember to do that. Leave a like before you watch and let's go. Okay, I'm Ryan again. Chapter 8, The Belly of the Beast. Oh god. Now we gotta make a decision that I made Laura show Where the bite. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. What a rude. Guys, <laughs> she murdered Kaylee. We'd have been over this. She's not dead, technically, right? Caitlin, what do I do? Let's see what Caitlin says. Uh, Caitlin? What do I do? Oh, wow. Real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <sighs> oh, no way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. I didn't it's want just... him to just yell at her, no, though. What's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. You said you heard a woman? Uh, all this over... Wait, you heard a woman. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? Because we all heard her. You know? The lady sang Silas. It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. No, I know that, but there's some there's other connection to it. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Is it silver? Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. Uh-huh. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Oh, God. That's what I'm kind of worried about, too. Like, if I kill oh, one of our oh, friends by accident. Someone. Yeah, thank you, Caitlin. <laughs> Once again, I find it so surprising that Ryan is the one that's the most skeptical when he so, listens to all these stories all the time. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. I don't think they know that. Wait. Would Ryan know? Because they were pretty close, remember? But I don't know if he would tell him that. What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Oh, Dude. there's a spooky house? What? Have you not thought about killing him? Uh... Uh, maybe there's another way? She said when she shot Chris- Well, she wasn't sure if that was Chris who she shot. The curse didn't lift. We're forgetting about Silas. That name that keeps showing up. That name keeps showing up every single time and the ghost lady keeps saying Silas. And remember what I said, the harem scarum thing, there was a freak show accident that happened here. What if one of the features was a werewolf and that happens to be someone named Silas? You know? We have to kill that person, but we don't know what they look like or who they are or where they are. I'm gonna- I'm gonna be compassionate first. Listen, there could because be Because they don't way. know about Silas about yet, that? right? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. 
So is Max. So is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the world? Right, what about Nick and Emma? Right. Come on, Ryan. Okay. Any clothes are going to have to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. Including us. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh... Yeah, what they said. Chris has nothing to do with this. No way you're going alone. How about, how about, oh my God. I see, I don't, I know what he's trying to happen because we know what's happening. Ryan doesn't know what's happening. So I understand his skepticism and he's really cl cl close with Chris. I, he considers him a friend, right? So obviously this is a little bit weird to him. I'm gonna be aggressive. There's no way I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on your own. Wow, are you flirting with me? What? No. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. <laughs> so we have no way to, to escape the island. Get some more Great. How, How can we? Have? The rotor arms in the an hour lake. Or two, I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Okay, I'm Laura now. The rain washed off their blood! Sure Dude, the right they needed that! Pretty sure, yeah. Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? This doesn't feel right. Have you been there? Have you actually been there before? I mean, no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. Maybe I shouldn't have let Ryan be how so well aggressive you know with his Hackett? answers. Because I don't know how he's going to react you know. now that we're alone. Like Nobody you're... else is with them. Sure I'm pretty sure right if Caitlyn or Dylan was with them, Ryan when would I chill out a bit. Camp, I was going through some personal... Mr. H helped me sort it out. He's a good guy. You don't know him like I do. You don't know him at all. Okay, I don't think okay, you do. Teacher's pet. Why are you like this? Uh, what do you mean? Why is she like that? Her boyfriend's a werewolf. She's bit and lost an eyeball. Also, she was stuck in a jail cell for two months. <laughs> what the hell? Um, let's just say that you don't Look, know anybody. I don't think anybody knows anybody. Not really. Does it? Yeah, exactly. Well, it doesn't Mr. matter. H, and, and he never hurt any of us. They, well, I, I know for a fact. And, and the thing the is, if they're werewolves, can, can they control themselves? I don't think they can. That's what his whole camp is all about, to help the kids. Yeah, I don't doubt it. We're not talking about that. You know though. what I have to do, right? I know. But only if we can't talk to him. We can't find another way. Lead the way. Oh, God, please tell me Ryan is not going to be like, hey, let me talk to you while he's a werewolf, and then Chris will just eat him. I hope that does not happen. Jesus. There it is. Hack your house. Creepy ass house with so barbed he wire. Lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's Jacob's probably, probably the best in place there. Right? They're probably hiding in there. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? I don't think there's, That's like, a front a gate they can just, like, question. go in. Maybe we just don't. Ryan! Whose side are you on? I get it. He's your friend. Okay, let's try to be compassionate. We understand, understand okay? Chris is your friend. If there was he needs to way, see it to believe it. I think that's what the thing is. Sure. Yeah. Laura, Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. 
Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. Yeah, killing Silas, wherever that guy is. Whoever Where they are. Going? You're on a timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. <gasps> Why did they move? <gasps> oh, shit. Holy shit. Are you okay? What the fuck? Laura? Where's Laura? <laughs> oh, gosh, she needs to get out. The water's the weakness. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Oh my god, Laura. Jesus, Mary and Jazz Hands. <laughs> Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax, look. Oh! What big eyes you have, Grandma. I regenerated her whole eyeball. Oh, I didn't shit. think that would happen. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Yeah. Define yellow? Shit. We haven't got much time. Oh my god, I don't want her to... Dude, we can't- I cannot kill Laura. I actually really like her character. She, she's definitely the final girl, like, ar archetype in horror movies, you know? That, that has to be her. Um... Okay, let me just take a look around. What the hell is that thing? A lunchbox? This must be part of the old working quarry. Wait a second. Forgotten belongings of a quarry miner. Abandoned in the tunnels. A letter of foreclosure within, it, within indicates that it has been down here since the 1930s. Makes sense. Wait, what did that say about Hackett? Hang on. I'm gonna read that. Wow, I, lo I love that I can see it. Great. Uh, <laughs> Dear Value Employee, I regret to inform you that the service at Hackett's Quarry will no longer be required. It is my intention to return the site of the Central Quarry to an area of natural beauty by flooding it and allowing the lake to form in its place. You'll be paid until the end of the week and then ask to vacate the premises. I'd like to thank you for your continued loyalty and wish you well in, the, in your future endeavors. Yours faithfully, Septimus... Hack it. What kind of name is that? Tight bastard can't pay us last time I trust to hack it. Okay, that's weird. So this used to be like a mining... What's with super massive in mines? <laughs> but yeah, this used to be a mining um, place. And yeah, I guess they just filled it up. That I guess that explains why that island is there. Remember how they were talking about it used to be connected with the rest of them? So I guess that's where they flooded everything. You think maybe this is where the werewolves were discovered under here? I don't know how that works. Either the freak show or they discovered it here in the in the quarry. I don't know. Mining tools. These must have been from the quarry days. Sorry. These rusted out tools are leftovers from Hackett's industry heyday before the mine's foreclosure. No duh. No one's been down here for years. Was that... What the hell was that? Was that a sound effect or was that something? Wait, can we take this? I would! Give it to fucking Ryan! Give him a weapon! Why do these people don't take little weapons? I never understood this. Okay. Oh god, these, these steps are rickety as fuck. You can even tell. I don't like the noise that they're making. They are so loud. Just double check. I didn't miss anything, right? Yeah, so I guess they brought Jacob down here. But that, that's my question. Like, do they keep all the werewolves down here? Like, what do they do with them? Did you hear that too? It's her. Who? Yeah, who's that? The hag of Hackett's Quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. I think she may 
be guiding us because remember in the police station with Max, she was like, they did this to us. And uh, it, that voice led them to the silver bullets. So. Oh, shit. That was fucking they loud too. Them? No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. <laughs> Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Hey, yo, Ryan, what are you doing? Jeez. What the f um, I just thought of something else, too. In the lake, when, you know, when Emma and Jacob were swimming around, that body, you think that that could be that lady who's whispering like, Silas and whatever, the lady running in the in the woods? Could that be her? Okay, let's see if there's anything over here. Ooh, a card, the lovers. The lovers, their harmony and disagreement brought to light by only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it and tasting it could save someone's life. God, thank goodness I got this card. This is a good card. Help save somebody later, I I'm hoping. Once again, I'm still hoping I will. Just look at this place. Save everybody. This is what I'm hoping for. Oh. Jump! Jump! But Jesus Christ, I cannot oh, see. Boy, this is high. Whoa. Okay, I'm not liking this. I'm just I'm just trying to look for, around if there's any more cards, which I don't know if there's gonna be any more in here. Oop. Do you think actually something is What the hell? A lump of what appears to be damaged scarred flesh. Ew! Here with us? Either that, or this route isn't as disused as we thought. I don't like that. I don't like that. Okay, anything else that I missed? Jesus, I've got Lonely the sound down. of that. Yo, Laura, don't say that, please. We don't need need any further analysis of like how high we are. This is scaring me. <laughs> well, cave and do not first enter. Cave out. <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. This ain't the time to joke. <laughs> Honestly, it's really not. Okay, um, let's go this way. So what's your deal then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. Oh, that is so kind of true. Don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? No, I don't think it's more like that. I guess I guess she is kind of stereotyping him, and I, I kind of low-key am as well, but it's just like, she does have a point. Normally, camp leaders are kind of like, very excited and, you know, uh, happy to be here. I'm not saying Ryan is probably, like, bad with kids. He, I, I assume he's actually good with the kids, but... He doesn't seem that stereotypical. You know, that's not what I meant. Let me be patient. You know, that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? Hmm. I mean. Oh, that's true. He used to be a now. camper here when he was a kid. Because he's close with Chris's your friend, um, uh, kids. Caitlin, is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Yeah, she, she has the hots for me. Doing those two. <laughs> You oh, notice his vote. My name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's just a fact. They're not exactly secretive about it. That is true. They're kind of so flirting what about like you? outright. Who do you like more. Ooh. I don't know. Maybe neither. Fair enough. 
Honestly, I want him to be with Dylan. That's just my opinion because I feel like they have more chemistry than him and Caitlyn. That's just how I see this it. This way. I see a light. But he doesn't have to be with anyone. That is 100% true. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. Okay. Their spinach. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? I say her, because she's bit at least, you know? <laughs> Ryan isn't, so... I think it's okay. Okay, he just goes ahead anyway. But I think it's okay that... Ooh, Wheel of Fortune! The Wheel of Fortune, after all. Fortune is nothing but spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but in favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Through the wheel spin... Uh, though the wheel spins, the eagle eye can tell which is going to stop. Oh god, I'm gonna have to decide between these cards? These are good cards. I think it's safe to assume like each chapter has like two cards, so I don't have to look for any more. Now it's a matter if there's any clues lying around. Looks promising. This looks dusty as hell. Ew. Okay, let's see what we got. Anything? No. What about this side? A lot of fucking spider webs though. I did say it was dusty. Is that a bowl? What is that? Hey, some- is that sh- oh, I don't think that's shotgun shells. If it was, I would just tell them to take it immediately. Is there nothing I can look at here? I just don't want to miss anything. I'm really worried about that. Okay, it looks like alcohol. Careful. Splinters. Right, I hate those. I always get Thanks. them when I when Fine. I handle. I'm not gonna say the next part because someone's gonna take out of context. <laughs> Alcohol and prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. How long yeah. does alcohol really I last? Think. I'm not an alcohol person. Like I don't really drink. I drink on occasion, but like, how I'm long do alcohol really people. last? It can sense. last for a long time, right? I guess when the cores are done, they branched out. Come on, time travel later. True. I would take that low key. If we have a lighter or something, you throw it and then, you know, make a Molotov or something. I don't know. That's a weapon, right? Okay, so this used this place used to be Damn, the Hackett family has been in a lot of stuff then, because they've they've done mining and then like I think this run is running. Uh beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. Yeah, me too. Shall we? I'm scared. Oh, okay, we're Caitlyn now. Okay, it's just Caitlyn and Dylan. And Dylan's got one hand, bro! Oh my god. Oh no, and Abby's there too. I forgot. <laughs> Dylan's got one hand, though. Did you lock the door? They need to hide somewhere. Uh... What the hell happened here? Um... Let's be honest. Uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the mean, other guy. I mean, he threw a table and threw Caitlin. That's kind of. What true. do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean should we go find them? Warn them? It's kind of too late for both thing. of them. <laughs> the most responsible thing is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. Right. And Nick. And Nick. Yeah, of course. We'll get Nick too. I really want to save him. I feel really bad about that because that was my fault. I still don't trust that fireplace, dude. I'm scared somebody's gonna just come on down it and then attack them. Okay, they need to fix the van. That's what? right. Somebody might be in there. You never know. Oh god, why are you making Dylan do it? Then again, Abby's not good with this stuff. Huh. Well, 
Let's see what the damage is. It's the rotor arm. How do you fix that? I don't know. Well, fix or no fix? Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. Man, what would have happened if I broke the fuel sounds line? Like I feel like that sounds a lot worse. Got something better to do? Okay, Dylan, we need you. Come on. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. <laughs> I'd kind of like to not die by staying here. No, we Abby. Don't need to go. No, no. Like that idea. No. Like, you're coming with me. Fuck. I don't want them to separate. Should I just but Abby go is not good on race? her own. You know, there's actually a shelter under the lodge. It's probably safer. Do you remember when we went into Chris's office and then I made Dylan open the hatch? The fucking ladder is broken. How is Abby supposed to get out of there? She's gonna die, dude. I'm gonna kill her. Is it locked? I don't think so. Good. Does that Great. Well, I guess there. Dylan wouldn't have noticed that he broke the ladder, but still. Dude, I'm like, I'm gonna get Abby killed. Good luck. Because of, she's gonna fall. Some shit. She has a silver bullet, remember? I have a feeling Nick is gonna go after her, right? Because they have this bond anyway, so... He's probably gonna go find her in the bunker, and then I'm gonna fuck up, and then she's gotta either shoot him or just get eaten by him. One of those options! <laughs> okay, this is another... <coughs> cellar. Please tell me that the door just closed because it's heavy door. You know? Please. What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. Guests as in Jacob? Or do they know that we're here? Keep it down. You keep it down. That's not a good sign. You know, oh, I'm right now. You know, I have a feeling that Travis doesn't exactly know what's going on in his family. Like, he doesn't know the full story of it. That's kind of like the vibe that I'm getting because like, ooh, the Empress. I feel like they kind of keep in the dark because they know that he's a good guy. The Empress, look at her. Those at the top can follow the heart. Hardest, shame, uh, such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you, but no less than she deserves. Okay, that's kind of concerning, but sure, I guess. This way, come on. From still. An antiquated, uh, antiquated rum still, likely from Prohibition days, a relic of the Hackett's family past. This is an old still. Why are we talking so loud? Hello? <laughs> That's a lot of rum. You think they still drink this stuff? I mean, the family. Ooh. Emperor. Damn, how many cards am I finding? I thought there would be only two. The Emperor, authority, paternity, structure designed to topple. No. How they might, how the money may fall and the empire is with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. Okay, that's uh, great, I guess. Jeez, poor kid. Head this big. Bobby. Who's Bobby? That's one of the guys, the hunters. I heard them call, I don't know if it's the big dude. I think it might be the big dude. The, I heard them call him Bobby, right? If I remember correctly. Anything in here? I don't like the music. What is happening? Okay, we just came from there. Okay, good, good, good. Just making sure, guys. Wait! I wasn't done! Hello? Careful. 
Okay. How did no one hear that? Wait! Jacob's gonna be in here. It's coming from a bed. Okay, so it's, it's okay, okay, never mind. It wasn't behind them. I thought it was behind them. Jacob's in there. He's gonna freak the fuck out. You know he is. Jacob. Shh. Please don't freak out. Yeah, I, I see. Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? Is he bit? Or is he just like losing it because... No. Hey. Bad idea. It's electric, remember? Damn, I could have like electrocuted Ryan just then. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Oh, it's he's electrified. Okay. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Okay. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> it's Kaylee. She's dead. Oh, she actually? No. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got a screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. Oh, damn! Okay, so she is officially dead. No. God damn. No. No, no. No, no. Not my granddaughter. Not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit! Not my little Kaylee! God damn you! What did you do to her? Why is she blaming him? Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? What is she doing? Wait, what is she doing? Are you fucking serious? Dude, I didn't know what she was doing! Oh my fucking god, now Travis is gonna come down here and I don't want Travis to get hurt because he's trying to do the right thing. Uh, I can't. <laughs> Fuck! Who's that? Laura. What have you done? <laughs> Wait, who are you? Wait. Coward! Wait. Hey, Ma! Sit! No! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I really thought he was just gonna be like, you know, be quiet or something and how Are you fucking kidding? God damn it! I, that's why I didn't say anything because I thought he would help. It. Oh my god! I'm fucked. Fuck. 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 This, this is so fucking stupid. Oh my god! I fucked up. Did you miss me? Ma'am, you have to help me! <laughs> you brought me some more of my- I don't know who she shot in the cage. Like, who is that? It could either be the grandson, um, Chris's son. It could be fucking Nick, could be Emma. Empress. We don't know, Max. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters, only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> But it's no less than she deserves. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement brought to light only. I might pick the lovers card because it says that you can save somebody, Blood and that's kind of what I want to do. <laughs> you can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone. 
The wheel of fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have I'm to I'm just take so a mad at myself. Dude, the first one though, like Laura favorite, walking, I didn't know what she was favorite, doing. Honestly, I I, I really wish that was more clear. Well, I really thought she was just gonna go up so to it. I didn't mean she was gonna shoot! The eagle eyed can oh tell. Oh my god. It's going this to is stop. so fucked. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, strictures designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall. And I'm so mad at myself, dude. I'm so mad at myself because I thought it would be fine. It's not. What? <laughs> Details. See more, see more. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness and watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Wait, how do I pick? What? Is this how I... Okay, I'm picking the... No, no, no! There we go. Lovers. I want to pick the lovers one. If, I, if it's mentioning saving somebody. Huh? Go. You still got time. Be careful now. Oh my and god! I know what that means! The lover's card, it said that it would save somebody. Since Laura is infected, what I'm assuming is she's probably gonna have to bite Ryan. We're gonna have to make a choice there. Bite Ryan in order to save him. Because remember that, that when she went to the island and she was gonna attack uh, or get on the boat to leave, that werewolf did not attack her. And then when Ryan said, why did they attack her? That's when she showed her bite. She was already bit. So maybe if we bite Ryan, that will save him from death. But he will be infected. That's the only thing. Okay, we're Dylan again. Have you been there Chapter before? Chapter 9, the Matriarch. Nah, just seen the sign on my way to camp. Okay, they're both covered in blood. I made sure Caitlyn got covered by the hunter. Dylan obviously covered what in his own just, blood. But I don't know like, if that matters. Walk to the main road. This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. <laughs> so basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever? Yeah. <sighs> what was that? Let's just keep moving. Why doesn't Dylan have a weapon? I know this man has one hand, but like, grab a hammer or something. So, I guess this is me now. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. <laughs> we can call you Hooky McHookface. No one will treat me the same. I guess that's kind of unique. Oh, I don't want Dylan to be sad. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. I could get different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. You could do like the Jamie it. Lannister thing and get like too. a fully golden hand. Yeah, you know, so you can bitch slap like people around. <laughs> We're all gonna be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. I think we missed our shot. We need some time. Ooh, curious. Because they both like I, Ryan. Uh, got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? There's always next year, right? Oh. Well, let's get through this. I like that they're not even in competition because they like the same guy. But you know, usually how like people are like really, really snappy with really each other when they like the same person. I like that they're not Confident. like that. That's pretty cool. Heroic. With an eye patch. So pirates. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> <laughs> there. How many things do like the the Hackett family own? They own a junkyard too. Oh shit! Relax. It's motion sensor. We're okay. I think. Oh, okay. oh look, steampunk's back in. Ew! Come on, this way. Yeah, but I don't. I I don't know. <laughs> I'm just nervous now. Get me down. Easy, ma. Fuck! Down, Why did I do that? Blow your fucking head off! Ah. Oh 
Oh shit, there we go. Everybody just relax. Can't shoot cool. what you can't see, darling. You think she can't see? I feel like she can. She's she's like part werewolf now. Gotcha. What if she just blasted her head off just no what she did to my Kaylee? Get the fuck off. You ain't hurting us anymore. I know, You're I know, done. I know she, I could have shot her. Everybody I think I would have shot her in the face, but I want to hear what they have to say first. That's why I was hesitating. I need to know. Because if we shoot the mother, bitch. then the fuck up. bad there things no will happen. Way to be talking to your mother. Yes. Is that his dad? That's probably his dad. <gasps> Put me down, asshole. What the hell is going on up here? We ain't keeping them safe anymore, Bobby. Not after what they did to our Kaylee. Distract, run. No, I ain't leaving Ryan. Are you kidding me? What the fuck is she doing? <laughs> what is she doing? Hey, little bitch. You're singing off key. He, he took my knife. Hey, we have a weapon now, but Ryan might be bleeding out. <laughs> she what? spit in my face. She spit in my goddamn <laughs> face. You better run. Oh shit! Yo, what is this? Like the fucking family from Resident Evil? <laughs> what the hell? God, Ryan, are you okay? Where are we? That was like a dumb waiter, whatever the hell it's called, right? Uh, 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 okay. All right, that's not good. No, that's not good. Oh my god, we probably have to... In my understanding of first aid, when you're stabbed, you're not supposed to pull anything out. Because it's basically a plug, even though, yeah, it hurts. It's a plug until somebody who knows what they're doing can remove it for you, which is technically Laura because she has first aid. Uh, I think, oh, God. It could be a weapon, though, but I don't, I don't. God damn it, I don't know. Leave it, leave it. I'm going to wait for Laura. She can handle it, I guess. I'm not doing that. I, I just feel like, no, maybe don't do that. Oh, God. Dude, what kind of house is this? Do they actually, like, live here? Or Because it looks like it just, everything's in darkness. I don't know. What was that? No, keep it. We, is it silver? We might need it. Kaylee's letter. Kaylee Hackett's letter of confession addressed to her grandmother. Wait, what kind of confession? What? Hey, yo, what did it say? Yo, Ryan, you can't just take it and just like not say anything. What did it say? What does it say? It won't even let me read it. What? What the fuck? Okay. Is it like, like, oh, I thought it was gonna be like a, like a trap door or something, you know? Death. Oh, that's the death card. 
Death. Death makes any uh, takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, transformation. Often are interpreted as a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it just means death. That is true. In actual tarot cards, death is not a bad card because it's normally meaning like transformation, like you get rid of the old and then you start a new kind of thing. But yeah, I have a feeling this actually just means death. So yeah, I kind of believe that <laughs> for this game, yes. <laughs> That's a door. Wait, hello, what's this? Damn, they still have like a, like a, yeah! Oh. They have like a, uh, what do you call those things? Chamber pots? Do these people not have bathrooms in their house? What is going on? That's disgusting, why did Ryan look at it? I don't know which door to go through. All right, I guess I'm going here. Ew, ew, ew. <sighs> it's like a closet? But there's another door on the other side. Hang on, what's this door then? Where the heck is Laura at? Everything's locked. Oh god, I hate it when they look in keyholes. It freaks me out. Oh, fuck! <gasps> Yo, hide, 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 hide. Ryan killed, man. He's gonna open up the cabinet and be like, who's in there? I just know it. Fuck, I should have gone under the bed. Maybe that would have been easier. They lock every room when they go enter? That's kind of crazy. That's kind of crazy, but I guess they, they know they could, they could be attacked at any moment, right? pull out the blade too. I imagine his blood would spill everywhere and he'd be like, what's that? Like, you know? God, please get the fuck out! Why would you do that? Ryan, close the door, you lunatic! Oh, Ryan, you are insane, man. <laughs> what? I'm close. Stand by. Over. We need to catch up with Laura. Where did she go? Dude, just leave. Just leave. <sighs> Fucking God, please. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker. You're a fucker. <laughs> yeah, yeah okay. great one, Ryan. <laughs> Shit. Now it's Laura's turn. Now I gotta get Laura out. Dude, that's so funny. Oh. Ron, get the fuck out of here. Keep moving, keep moving. Shit. I, I remember that from Little Hope, eh? <laughs> if anyone's played Little Hope. <laughs> oh my god, please. Where are we now? Oh, I ain't touching no piano. Get out of here. Is that a skull? There are bears around here. 
Spoils of the hack and hunting prowess. You'd think they want to cover their bullet wounds and sign of any injury, perhaps to uh, sever a reminder that these animals are definitely dead? I guess. I really don't get the whole, like, trophy when hunting. I, f I find that very weird. Do I check the piano? Maybe? I don't know. There might be a secret there, or it just might be a piano making noise. No! I ain't playing! Just look at it! <laughs> God. I'm not fucking playing it. I'm gonna run out of time to look around. I'm not doing that. You can tell these people are weird. Like how many hunting trophies they have. <laughs> That's how you know. rooms are in this fucking house I hate this oh the sun the sun the vitality of a new day there's still time to wake up and the warmth of the night survive your choices your actions your very ha life hangs in the very balance it's up to you to find the path in darkness and see the sun once again you may pick that card not gonna lie okay there's a crow out there that's that's great What am I looking at? Oh God! Who the fuck is that? That's the the lady. No, don't go in there. I wasn't done looking. Uh, uh, how do you do it? I wasn't done looking. I wasn't done looking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, can I- wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Sorry, but like, can I- is it possible that I can like, redo it? Ah, oh, fuck, no, I can't. Sorry, guys. Uh, uh, how do you do it? Damn it, I wanted to look mm -hmm. around still! There's more secrets, obviously. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Look at Laura, she's definitely changing a lot. You ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. <laughs> Careful, Jim, she looks awful. No, oh, she's been bit. <sighs> you know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you. But I sure to hell can make you suffer. Um... Fuck, we're gonna fight, I guess. Come on, Laura! Mm. Oh shit, yeah, everything's affecting her now. Run! Filthy animal! Get up! Come on! She can't see right now! Get out of here! Don't let her run, Jed. Cut her down. Oh my god, I just saved Jacob's life. Well, I mean, I don't know if that matters. He had blood on him, but I did save him. Because, like, if, if she did that and then the werewolf is still alive, we would have been fucked. Jacob, get the hell out of there, man. Go. She can see in the dark. She's one of them. What are you? What do you mean, what are we? I'm gonna enjoy watching you die, girl. These people are so weird! Hey! Everybody fucking stop right now! Take her head off, Travis. She's bit. Yeah. Yeah, fill her with silver. No, don't do it! 
Travis, no! Come on, you're a good guy! Wait! Oh. Shoot him! He hesitated. Okay, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. He hesitated. Pleasant for you, I promise you that. Fuck, Ryan's lo losing blood. He's walking slower. This is not good. I, I apologize for the last part. I wish I looked around better, but I, I guess it doesn't matter because, like, she would have probably been found in the other room, right? Probably. <sighs> Damn, he's so fast. Come on, Ryan. I won't tell anyone anything. Ah, oh, fuck! No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. If I stab. Fuck it. He's gonna kill him anyway, right? Ow! You stabbed me! Yeah, <laughs> That's not the reaction I, I thought! I've never been stabbed before! <laughs> Leave me alone. Uh, oh, it really hurts. Dad! Oh. Wait, so that's Travis and Chris's brother then? I thought there was like a cousin or something, or family friend. God damn, Laura! <laughs> hey, hey, hey! It's me! It's me! What the fuck happened to you? They oh, stabbed yeah. me! Did yeah, you not see that? Right. Oh, Ryan. He has to get bit. Oh. He has to heal his wound. That's the oh, only gosh. way. I'm so sorry. <sighs> that bad, huh? She's gotta bite him. We saw I that in the clear card. It. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how are you? I didn't want to say it. It's not your fault. No, it's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's no one's fault, at I least the campers. I didn't fucking know. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. Sorry. It's okay. Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. What? Ryan, if you let me bite you what if you yeah it's gotta happen you, it means you'll be infected which means which means it will heal 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is so but it also fucked means... up. Yeah. Yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. Because she's gonna it's transform. It's killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. And mine. And Max's and your friend's, too. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much. It's your call, for now. Well, I'm glad they're making us, like, have a choice over this. Are we doing this, this or no? Uh, I say yes. We have to. Yep, let's do it. Do it. Look, this is the only chance to save everybody, because if I don't, Ryan's dead for, sh for real this time. Uh. So... Nice and tender for you. <laughs> well, I'm glad he's kind of joking about it, so that's nice. You should start to feel better soon, I guess. This is all kind of fun. Yo, we need to leave though! We gotta go. Get up, Ryan, please! This game is so stressful. <laughs> okay, we're back as Dylan. Now we're at the scrapyard. These guys never throw anything out, huh? So, Apparently not. Do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped of parts. Just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. Uh, okay. I don't know anything about cars. I'm like Dylan. I don't know, so... Yeah, this should be fun. Alright, let's check this one. Looks like we got our work cut out for us, huh? Try not to make too much noise. Oh, right. That is kind of true. Let's not do that. Anything by you? <sighs> Not yet. Keep looking. Nothing there. Um... I don't know which side of the- oh my god, I don't know which side of the scrapyard to go, so we'll go this way, I guess. <laughs> oh shit! Sorry. Keep forgetting the fucking lights! Hey, that could also be an alert to us, because if the lights do go on and we're not walking past it, it could mean that there's just another person there, right? Like a werewolf, for example. Yup, I hate it, thanks. Okay, this may have something. Hmm. 
Big green button. Hmm. We are just saying. Hang on a second, wait. Let me look around if there's like any other clue. Highly doubt it, but could be a card, you never know. Let me go upstairs. It's up here. Sons of bitches had it all planned out. Oh yeah, they definitely did. It's just a matter of what I don't understand is why hunt them? Aside from the fact that we know that because Chris is like their son and the grandkids are also infected. Like what is the point of like the hunting part is what I'm trying to gather. The scrawled request to keep something off the books is a little dodgy to say the least. There must be something that they don't want anyone to know about. Just keeps Who's off the tea? Books. Mm -hmm. Travis. Looks like these guys were cooking the books a little. <sighs> That's all I could think, Travis. You said it. Wait, can I read that again? SUV body damage. Keep this off the books and out of the way. T. Okay, so ADFF674. So I guess. Oh, that van! Remember, remember that um, uh, Chris and Travis were talking about in the jail cell when we were playing as Laura? That, that must be that van that they were talking about. Noises. Caitlin, please keep that shotgun ready. I am just saying. Alright. Oh, fuck me, dude. I don't want to go in there. Fuck! I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this. What's with the- Oh, fucking me. Okay, alright, we're good. It's fine. It's fine. Caitlin, you better fucking shoot. I swear. I swear. Please shoot. Whoever is out here. It could be Chris. It could be Max. At this point, it could be fucking Emma, because we haven't seen her in a long time. I don't know where I'm going, dude. Where are we going? Please! I can't do this! What the fuck? I hate this. Oh my god, this is freaking me out. Hey, what's up here, huh? Look. <sighs> Shit. Oh no, we gotta drop that. It's gonna make noise and we're fucked. I know it. I know it. Oh so... God. You ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. Nope, nope, uh-uh. Uh-oh, I hear that now. 
Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down really so creepy. I can take a look under the hood? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Watch my back. Well, I mean, if he takes the gun, how is he supposed to operate the crane and shoot at the same time? Caitlyn's a better shot, but it's a shotgun, so it's it, it has a wider spread, but the distance is not, you know. Fuck, please watch my back. I don't know. Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. Oh, God, this is gonna suck. I'm gonna hate this so much. Yo, Dylan's doing the most. He's taking, like, the number one spot uh, of, like, my favorite character now. I put him first, I put Laura second, and then I'll, I'll put Ryan right. third. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Okay, let's see what Wait, how's he gonna operate this with one hand? Alright, not too complicated. It's probably gonna be loud, though. Forever. What the hell is going on? My bad. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Jesus! Alright. Here goes nothing. Oh my god. Please. Caitlin, please. I'm begging you. Wait, who am I controlling right now? Is it Ryan? Or is it Dylan or, or Caitlyn? You did it! Yeah. Uh, Let's not celebrate yet, please. About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. Oh, score! Dylan? Um... Oh, fuck. What do you mean, lift car? What is that gonna do? Lift the car and fucking whip it around? No, I'm gonna tell Caitlyn it might not. Oh, shit. Does it really matter? Because Caitlyn's fucking yelling in there and it's already seen her. Oh, shit! <sighs> Please hang on. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. <gasps> Dude, I thought I killed Caitlyn. She landed on the tires, though. Holy fuck. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. Can For we please reason. leave? Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. <laughs> Don't push it. Okay. Oh my god. 
So, so much for our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? <laughs> Better than being out in the open. Come on. I agree. Let's fucking leave, please. God. Did she get what she needed from that? I don't even know if she got what she needed. Oh, I'm at. Oh no, I'm fucking Abby. Abby, no, I'm gonna counselor. kill this girl. Summer camp, Abby. You'll learn how to interact with people better, and you'll have loads of fun and make friends for life. I'm so sick of people telling me. To now. Hello? Is this lady supposed to be helping us? Is anyone like, there? I don't know what she's doing. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck is right. Okay. Yep, not a fan of this. I don't want to open that. Is that, like, leading me to open it? Because I ain't fucking opening it. Oh, the Hierophant. Uh, my poor boy, did you see what they did to us? How they hurt us? He's still out here. Or still, uh, still out there still. All alone, full. Each full moon they hunt him, armed with silver, trying to put an end to the curse they inflict upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children. But little Silas, my little white wolf, he must be protected. He must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I helped you all this time. The lady, the tarot card lady. Is the ghost lady, right? The hag of Hackett's quarry is her. I'm kind of interested in picking the Hierophant card now because that kind of seems like a warning. Remember how I've helped you all this time. All right, Miss Ma'am, I'm gonna have to try to remember you said that. Don't like how dark it is in here. I wish I could see. I thought that was the mom, yo. I don't think that was the mom. That was uh, the tarot card lady. Okay. You know, if she wanted to help, she didn't have to be so creepy. Like, just tell me what to do. Stop, like, creeping around there. You're freaking me out. Is that a vent? Oh, okay. Wait, huh? That's why the lights went out. Thunder must have come this way before he attacked us upstairs. Oh my god, I can't do this. Dude, she's gonna die because of the stupid fucking ladder. Why did I do that? Huh. Trap door. Someone's watching. Ain't no way. Please don't break. Please don't break. I'm begging you. Please don't do that. 